I think you're amazing. I know you're you know, amazing, your Uncle. College educated upper middle class males speak about these issues. I hope you heard some of the other events, right, that are going to be happening. And you know, there are events on this campus and in the community all the time that happen where folks of color engage these issues, where women of all colors engage these issues, where LGBTQ folks engage these issues, where working class folks try to engage these issues. And I hope, I really sort of insist that the only way we're going to build a movement for real liberation is when a crowd like this will show up, not just for the white, straight, upper middle class, cisgendered male, but for all of those folks of color who do the work every single day in this community, on this campus, and all around this country. And without whose work, I and other white folks who do the work wouldn't have a thing to say. So please make sure that you come to their events and that you and that you listen to their wisdom. Because even though I've got some stuff to say and I intend to say it, and I intend to say it relatively well, you know, so hang out. It's gonna be good, you know. Um, there are a lot of other folks who say a lot of really important things, and they say them every bit as well or better, and sadly, they get ignored. So here we are, a um, little over eight years ago, when Barack Obama was elected president, I remember like that very week, right, going out and speaking to folks, and remember getting emails like that week, you know, I remember this one, all capital letters, red font, so you know it's going to be bad, right? All, all capital letters and red font, 